Hey guys, another one bites the dust. Uh, I don't see any. I've got a magnifying glass just so you guys can see some more details, hopefully. Um, I can't really see anything wrong with this fish. Just trying to show you. I mean, it, I just don't know. It had a problem breathing. Definitely know that. They were at the top. And then, um, the odd thing is that's number three. I've lost three now uh, in a 24-hour window. And I still have this guy right here doing fine. Can see him. He's right under there. That is the cardinal tetra. I don't believe I have any more cardinal tetras. I believe that all the others that are left are neons that are here in the back. Uh, there might be one left that's a cardinal um, hiding out in the deep weeds. I don't know. I mean, no clue. No clue, never seen anything like this, where I have a single species go belly up. Uh, I did do a water change. I did add prime. Uh, maybe there was something in my water uh, that I just can't see or detect that, uh, that impacted the cardinals, because they are pretty sensitive. The other fish that I have that's really sensitive is the uh, twig catfish or the fuella. And if it's dead, you know, I don't know, it's like a murder mystery. Um, you know, I've been doing this a long time. I've never really seen this in the hobby. So uh, if somebody wants to shed light, you let me know. I'm probably going to break my filter down here pretty soon and uh, maybe add some new resin because I'm starting to get the hair algae. I think the resin really tends to help keep that clear for me. Uh, I do not see my twig catfish. I'm assuming it's alive. I'm going to look for it here later. I'll go ahead and post this tonight. This is going to be the last video for me for the day. But there's my only... You see it in the back. I don't know if you saw it. I've got a cardinal swimming around back in there in the back, right? Well, you can't really see it. It's right there in the shadows. But that is a cardinal. I have one. I don't know what's going on. No clue. All these guys are fine. Perfectly healthy. No ick. Man, I've had ick, ick outbreaks before. No ick. Everybody's fine. Everybody's healthy. Um... Body language is good. Everybody's body language is good. Nobody's at the top sucking for air or, you know, breathing hard. Never see anything like it. So you guys let me know. Uh, if you know what it is, I'd be happy to, happy to hear. So uh, this is it. This is really the 120. I'm going to do a little bit of maintenance tonight. Um, not a lot, but just a little. Still trying to figure it out. You guys let me know. Uh, time to go flush a fish. What a weird day. Three, uh, you know, it's funny, I was worried about finding floaters while I was out on vacation. Come back, do maintenance, and uh, I don't know. I don't know. I, I have cut my water flow back to a normal level, as you can see, uh, just because. Uh, I'm trying not to run it super, super heavy um, for the fish. I don't think the, f the fish don't always like it going that fast. I don't know. That's just my call. We'll see. Uh, you know, might be something else I have to learn. But uh, you guys take care. Sorry about the glare from the lights. It's a little better here. That didn't help you much either there, did it? Anyway, thanks for watching. Let me know. Keep me, uh, you guys, feel free to ping me. Tell me what's up. I got no clue. Later.